guys, welcome to my channel. Today I have two really cute and new palettes from ColourPop. I'm going to be sharing with you how I got this look that I'm wearing. I'm also going to be showing you some swatches and then make sure that you stick around for the end because I will be sharing with you a review and my final thoughts. And so without further ado, let's just jump into this. So here we have the eyeshadow palette. It comes in this little paper protective sleeve. If you open up this palette, there are four shadows on the inside. Each of these shadows are 1.5 grams. There are three matte shadows and then one shimmery shadow. So this first matte shade is the shade Slim Fit. Next is the shade Centerfold. Next is the shade Issues. And last is the shade Take a Break. Moving on to the Knockout palette. Again, it comes in a paper sleeve and you can just pull this palette right out. On the inside of this palette, you will see a pressed powder blush in the shade Excuse My French and then a pressed powder highlight in the shade Like to Watch. And both the blush and the highlight are 8 grams each. Here I will swatch Excuse My French. And now we'll swatch Like to Watch. Alright, so for this look, I want to incorporate all the shadows into this look. So I'm going to first start off with this lightest shade right here. Now this is going to go right into my crease as my transition shade. Next, I'm going to go in with this shade right here. This is again going to go right into the crease and it's also going to go on the outer half of my eyelid. And now I'm going to go in with the darkest matte shade in this palette. Again, this shade is going right into the crease but lower than the previous shades. It's also going to go on the outer third of my lid as well. And now I'm just going to go in with this shade right here and this is just going to go on the inner half of my lid. And then to finish up the eyeshadow today, I'm going to be taking the two darkest shades. I'm going to be smoking out the lower lash line. I am going to be concentrating this darker shade on the outermost portion of my eye. So now I'm just going to throw on some of my Tarte Lash Paint Mascara and I'll be right back. Alright, so now it's time to move on to the face palette and I'm going to start off with the blush. And I'm just popping this on my cheeks as per usual. And then now I'm going to attempt to pop this highlighter on my face. It looks a little bit dark for me, but I'm going to try to make it work. To finish up this look, I'm going to be using this ColourPop Matte X Lippy in the shade Upside Down. And then adding a little bit of that highlight to the center. Alright, so that completes the look. Now for my thoughts on these two products. So to begin with the eyeshadow palette. So this was actually my first experience with ColourPop's powder shadows and I was not disappointed at all. These were all very pigmented. I didn't have any sort of fallout. I absolutely love the color range that is in here. I think that it complements my blue eyes and I just really think this palette is perfect for the spring and summer months. Now moving over to the face palettes, I will begin with the blush. I absolutely love this blush. I think it's really pigmented and a very, very beautiful color. I think this is going to be, again, perfect for spring and summer. Now, now moving on to this highlighter, I was worried because it is a little bit dark for my fair complexion and I wasn't really sure how that was going to work out, but I was really impressed with this highlighter. I think it is going to be very beautiful and perfect for me. And the reason that I think that this worked out still for me is because it wasn't quite as pigmented as the other things that I tried today. It definitely was buildable, so if you do have a darker skin tone than I do, I think that you will be able to build this color up and I think it will also be beautiful for you but because I could apply it very light and get that more sheer of a color it was still able to work for me and so this was also a win for me as well. Alright guys well that is everything for today I really hope that you enjoyed this video if you did please be sure to leave me a thumbs up and until next time guys bye!